have a good day. Oh, hello, LA Beast. And here today, I'm down at the beach, uh, just enjoying a nice sunny day sitting here on the deck. Uh, but it's also right around one year since I was here last. Uh, and also like right around the time that I celebrated uh, last year my 11th year on YouTube and right here right now my 12th year on YouTube. So what I'm going to do, and what I did last year, I went to Pete and Elda's. Uh, it's a very famous pizza spot. They're known for a very delicious thin crust pizza with a nice crunch to it. And they offer a 2XL 18 inch pie pizza challenge. Uh, and as long as you can finish it in one sitting, you get a free t-shirt. So um, I, I feel like I'm gonna start a tradition here as I come down to the beach with my family. Uh, instead of just doing one 2XL pizza this year, because it's the second year, I'm going to be adding another ginormous pizza. Uh, and last year, the time that I completed one was three minutes and 30 seconds. And going into this thing in probably about 20 minutes or so, I have zero competitive eating practice. So my guess here on what it's gonna take for me to eat two, two XL, 18 inch, Pete and Elda's delicious pizzas, I'm gonna say four minutes and 59 seconds is my ultimate goal. When cows fly. So without further ado, let's head on over. And here we are. Again, at the world famous Pete and Elda's, I'm hungry, I'm ready to go in there and dominate not only one, but two. On a cold day in hell. Two XL, 18 inch pizzas. Why? Pretty much basically just for the free t-shirt. Uh, and I actually learned that they switched it to a new design or else I would have gotten the same one I got last year. Interesting, a little bit nervous, but I guess once I start actually biting the pizza, I'll start the timer. Right. Three, two, one, go. Now my strategy coming into these double 2XL ginormous pizzas at Pete and Elda's ice cold with zero competitive eating practice in a while was simply just to fold two slices into one so hopefully I would eat the whole pizza faster uh, and then pretty much I was thinking you know what if I could eat one of these in three minutes and 30 seconds why not just say hey I can eat two of them in four minutes and 49 seconds I also had a glass of water uh, which is a, a great liquid to get food down and then also something with carbonation like a soda uh, for flavor fatigue because definitely when doing pizza challenges the cheese gets cold uh, and, and eating cold cheese is not fun even though it is Now you're witnessing solid fold over pizza form. There I am taking a bite and I'm gonna shut the heck on up. Now excuses are the nails that build the house of failure. And in about a second, I, I'm getting my bearings straight right there because it was a lot harder to chew the pizza. I feel like it's a thin, thin sliced pizza, but I felt like it was just a little bit thicker. That's what she said this year. Can I beat my time of three minutes and 30 seconds? That is yet to be determined at this point in this video. Solid switch up to the soda for flavor fatigue. I think I'm gonna stop commentating now. Now here I was checking the timer on the clock on my phone uh, and at like two minutes and 26 seconds, I realized that quite possibly I was semi in trouble uh, because I had two ginormous slices of pizza sitting there in front of me still. Um, but you know what? Even with a little bit of doubt in my mind, I, I continued to push on because I had three very special guests uh, come watch me up. And you know what? 
them. Exactly. Uh, just shoveling, shoveling food into my face. What I did, I actually scared my niece, uh, who had five different looks on her face. Scared, fear, disgust, concern, and disgust. Uh, but you know what? Um, because I had those special guests there, I had to push on. Alright, so as you're about to see... Oh, okay, but you know that you're seeing it right now. I did not beat the time that I set last year of 3 minutes, 30 seconds, 0.02. Uh, I believe the fastest time that someone has ever eaten one of these pizzas. Uh, it's something ridiculous, like 2 minutes and 20 seconds. And the record for somebody eating the most double XL pizzas in one sitting is 3. So, uh, here I am about to almost finish the first pizza pie here and probably for the next one minute and 27 seconds I do a lot of chewing so feel free to skip forward Now at this point, things were starting to go downhill pretty fast as I started shaking uh, and literally sitting right across the table were my two other special guests that are probably watching this video right now. Um, and you know what, they got a front row seat to watch me shovel the rest of this first double XL pizza into my face. So to keep the momentum going, what I decided to do was move the tray, uh, the second tray pizza to the top there. I'm, I'm nodding my head with approval, keep trying to keep it down, sweating profusely trying to keep it down, um, chewing, probably going to be chewing for the next 30 seconds, trying to make more room there by, by massaging the stomach. Look of concern, definitely a look of concern, but because my special guests were there, I had to keep on plowing forward. Even though I failed, thank you for coming anyway. Okay. Much respect, LEDs. Fail. Can I eat more than a double XL pie and a couple slices? Absolutely. Uh, but the feeling of being full and me actually looking at these delicious slices of pizza, I wanted to spew all over the place. Uh, so I, I got my free T-shirt for eating the one double XL pizza, and I've decided right here, right now, that I'm going to start my tradition next year. Because instead of got goo, 